sit down the artist walk out. Hey girl, they run a studio. Run our studio, I deal with artists. Women are like, can you call up my name? And I mean, I say, what are you talking about? Me just, me go, I do play, I go look. I'm mean, a big, I do play, I don't want to give me something. I understand better. The artist never want you, nothing. I say, I don't know what the artist do. Take up one big piece of board and when him done broke it up on me. You know me lick me on my back left right hand. Me talk about artists wanna love and say we meet every day when we see the artists and we see the people that run him down and people that say them love this man. The man take the board and lick me straight right back through the, the iron gate. Right through the gate. <laughs> Oh God! <laughs> oh God! My artist broke on the board. Why oh my God? I didn't be going twenty man them stand up there. I said, why is that girl? How she be getting? I got this. I share this yo. How she got chatting with the next all this girl argument? He said he couldn't believe it. A twenty more man stand up there watching man take the board. I beat me up and broke up the wood for me. I could not do a run. When me run, when me run, me see the nearest police station. Oh, me run going there. One of the wickedest things happened to me when me run going to the police station. The, the superintendent and the next artist, Uncle Jesus Christ. When me see that I make the complaint, the boss said, be a rare, rare uncle. Yeah, I feel lucky, but I'm going to say, Lord Jesus, I'm going to mix up this a bit in that. I said, what I'm looking to me for, I'm going to board, my board broke up, I know, I still have the mark in my back. I don't talk, I never talk. And then I start fret now because the people where I know we do my things. But I just say, me understand, I tell you, I said, fear one might be that type of abuse, but the abuse this same way, like, me the feel so abused, 20 strong man turn up there, watch the artist beat me up, and the whole of the man, the man laugh, like, 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 you know, like, me and a body, like, and them tell them, I'm not, I'm not career yet, I'm not boss or nothing, so some of me tell myself, I'm not bad at the music, some of me tell myself, I'm done with it, and then now, Mama said, me um, me go go the station now and go book up on the inspector. Me book up on the inspector. The next artist uncle, if the inspector hear him, gonna or the superintendent, they know what. If he hear this alive, I'm gonna say yes. Me they tell him to lock him up. And but by the time them say. Them they lock him up. Me they feel bad because they they, they tell the artist manager. Me love him because the, the manager take care of me without him. I look me up that the manager not do not no no harm to me. The, the manager is such a nice person. So by this time in the evening, when I go home, the manager call me. I said to myself, please, me I beg you, but they said nothing, and me go send some money come give, and it's not even the money that me even accept the apology. Is the fact that me never boss yet, I'm in on nobody, and and that situation would have been like maybe me to lose my life. Me don't know, me don't know, me still gonna lose it. No, because when them here, them are gonna say, but we tell her not to talk, and we give her money, or this or that or whatever. But to me, get so old now, and nobody no business about me in music. And the, the same artist, me say, talk to me enough time. The artist that talk to me, see me, and like, me say, him no member. Way to me, he me, me I run joke and say to him, say, Don't sing with me, and nah, I nah, know nah, you know, look for me for years. Me I say that, I mean, I say, if I, if I do that for apology or something, nothing that means that the person that the person that hate me or something because you could never beat up somebody after me, you know, so I look at dub plate hustling me. I do as so me live because me want to survive till my career take off, and you never give me one yet. Me no cure me beg the artist are the biggest thing at that time. I me beg you a dub plate and you don't never give me. I me go to a next man now and the man give it to me. And you know in order, you don't know where, where your man them are, your, 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 the man them were par with you. Come say to you about a little poor girl like me. A little poor girl like me at that time. Me, me and no body. Me and no body. Me just come a studio and try to look at boss. And me don't know what I could have said to you for you to take a board and broke it up on me. And for years me walk with that pa my brain and pa my head. 
and me, me does not know how and me see her talk to me, me see the artist talk to me, me see people love me, me, me not talk about a normal artist. Me not talk about a normal artist, I talk about artists where I make millions every day, every year, where oh, where people love. You understand? And the manager called me now and said, The more give me some money, and if it just relax, I'm a good, I'm a good doctor, I'm a good this, I'm a good that. And I'm not tell my mother, I'm not tell nobody, I'm not tell my parents, I'm not tell nobody, I'm just still, because I'm telling my mother they leave Ghana foreign anyway. And I'm kind of the my own still, you know? You know, and when the manager called me, I couldn't, I couldn't, I couldn't press the charge. Because that the manager there is somebody who help me out a lot. Any problem I have, them turn and, and make me escape a lot of other stuff, you know? So, I accept the money. I never not tell a lie. I accept the money. And I remember, I said to myself, say, them turn will have one something and what not. And I tell myself, I'm going to buy one big what not with the money. Because I told the money enough. I'm going to buy one big double side whatnot and put it in my house and put it in front of me and said, This is going to remind me every day. And I'm uh, kind of sorry to do that because every time I look on it, I cry because I say, Man, can't wicked, so Oh, you feel take board and beat me so in front of everybody at studio. I run through the gate, I run through the gate, I run, I don't know how I'm not dead. I know I don't know how I'm still alive. God no. You understand? So me just are saying, now all the things we go through as women in the business and me not really come up the stairs long because me know them are gonna drag me and people are gonna drag me, but me just are try to say when me hear about whatever people are go through, me are trying to make people know say me my thing them not normal. Uh, what they are saying I gonna do one documentary because the things that when me go through I want different type of something. Me not say people not try to say right sex or whatever, but me, me as me tell you now, me come in, me go in the business with a shield. Like me, me go in there with the intention say nobody. Now I go force me if I have no sex, you know? And then I travel power with people where you know good to me and you know and treat me with respect. You know, so I start to power with a lot of different people where show me a lot of respect and what me I try to tell them is that this was one of the journey them boy throw shoes in my chest. Me go to studio them I tell me say people run me out of them studio. You know, you know, whole heap of things. Whole heap of things. It's been and, and and right now me just feel like sometimes I just feel like the artist will just address it to me and say, Boy, you know, say me the kinda be a big man about that and say no say me the feel fuck up because me shouldn't really take no board and beat you up like that because you know, me don't know if I'm not feel like I eat that right now because twenty and the twenty man then when they turn up they're like I wanna do that, I wanna make that happen like when me do more than me just go go look dub plate and me go get the dub plate and come back happy. And you now give me no double plate and me get beaten for that. Because me have to stay neutral, me can't stay between two man or three man or four man if me if una, if them not if them not talk. Me have to stay neutral in a, in between everybody so just that me do that try to stay neutral. Because me no boss, me no reach no way. I can't, I can't call the name. I can't call the name. I can't call the name because I reach half a journey in my life and I want to finish it. So, what I try to say is, I just make you know, and I just make Tanya know, say, you're not alone, darling. I got you to, it might be a different way, but I got you to, and I have a thank God for a few of my friends and a couple of people who take care of me. And, Never been abusive. Me go through it too with couple of people, but them just verbally abuse me and them disrespect me and them try for you know. Anyways, um, I may go on my journey. Me, um, I head to the airport. Um, on a good note, I'm still alive. I'm still here. My career end up took off. Um, 
Yeah, and then you know, I'm going to add drama too. You know, funny enough, when my career took off, me and the same artist end up on a big show in America. And you know what that artist did? Trying to get me to come to his room to sleep with him. And I was like, like seriously, after that big boy beat me up, you really think that me or going to hotel room to sleep with him? That's all daring. It, you know, anyway, me love you guys, you know. Um, Daddy Reds and the whole family over there are big up, you know. Um, I know everybody was expecting to hear a different type of topic, but I mean, this was one of my most abusive situations I've ever been through. In this music business everything that's why i see when people come for the net and them might drag me and me this and me that and me, 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 me go through worse so what else can you guys do to me to feel let me feel anyway you know um but in the morning big up some of the people missing on the live yeah diverse big up daddy reds Yeah, that's the rest. Big up. Um, I don't have a phone to ring and nobody to say, Ray, Ray, where you dig up this and dig up that for because you never talk about it. But I just want to get it off of my chest. I just want to get it off of my chest and say, The artist, when they take the board and beat me up, I love you the same way. Enough love. I me, me, me get over it in a way. I always dig up in my brain now. But I not eat nothing. Everything blessed. And not because I come and I talk about it now. I got to dig up nothing on the police station and a problem. Nothing. But just uh, make the people them know say part of my journey wasn't easy also. You understand? Big up Dan Mafia, big up yourself. When I go to you them, big up yourself, Mafia. Mafia was one of them with the road me and saved me through my journey, you know? Where him, him, him one of them I know a lot of things I'm gonna go through. <sighs> I remember one day the unicorn may soul rest in peace. The unicorn get a little bit aggressive with me one day many of them argue and then tell me because suck me mother left right and sent and I done my fear to defend it for me, you know? So I have some people will defend me sometimes, so I have to give thanks to them and big respect. Anyway, bye guys. Um me know me know what got the internet I got drag right left side. me used to it. But anyway, me not care. I'm gonna be winding up my little body. Winding up myself and full join myself. All right, love you guys, enough love and thank you guys. Remember to follow me though, follow me on Instagram and um and TikTok. Just follow me, guys. Um, you know, my journey, my journey hasn't been it. It, it wasn't an easy one. I was still, not, it's still not easy. I'm still here and I'm still doing what I have to do. So I want to say enough love to those who stick out with me. Um. For the for, for quite a while and um and still is there with me. All right. Love you guys. Somebody somebody should turn off the thing then, but me not worry about who I said nothing from who I said this. Me just wanting to know say me get this off of my chest. My career still me, after, after that couple of years after me, me become one of the biggest artists. Them could have stand up beside every artist and perform and um me want to big up the artist too. this is the artist when me get the beat now over him know himself because i told him i told him the artist where where, where, where i told the artist you know because me the, me the, i i think i owe that artist to tell him because i was trying to ask him if when I was around there, if we had discussed that other artist, and I said, no, nothing like that, and really, really, so, um, I'm going to big up the artist, there because the artist there was one of them people that were helped me during my journey, to keep me monetary with my little dub play program, you know, big up to the artist, them where, you know, used to give me a little free dub, and make us speak with the, with the sound man, them, no love, me love, you know, you know, all right, so love you guys, I feel I watch the road, it come like a me so that's why I'm not even look. I look I look, I look at the camera too much up on the road. Alright. Who are calling me? But you say you still like a marry me. But you say divers. Oh, one of the best. Okay. Alright, sweetheart. Big up divers. Love you, my sis. And um, big up to everybody. Alright. Later guys.
Enough love.